everyone. So today is a big day. Well, my sister is nominated for seven Emmys, just how I've told you guys before. And today we're headed to San Francisco. And this is the beginning of my beautiful day with my sister's special day. Right now she's getting her hair done. My mom and I are going to the mall just to pick up some last minute um, jewelry. <laughs> and we're just so excited for tonight. Bro, yes. I get to go to the red carpet. <laughs> mom, we're making it in life. <laughs> my mom is so fabulous. Look at her. <laughs> she got new shoes. She got new shades. Hello, mama. How you doing, girl? How you doing? Yeah. <laughs> All right, a little behind the scenes before tonight. How do you feel? She's nervous. <laughs> Mixed feelings. Aww, everything's gonna be okay. <laughs> it's like when you work so hard and it's like you hope it's seen, you know? Aww. And you really pray it, it gets seen. Look at this beauty. Alright, we have our hair done for tonight. Now we just gotta get back to the house and get ready. You guys are gonna look my see my sister. She's gonna look bomb. So we're officially back on the vlog, but now we're on our way to the Emmy. <laughs> she looks so beautiful. Look at her. <laughs> my mama and my brother somewhere back there. He's taking a nap and my dad's in the front. But we're so excited. Today's your day. How do you feel? I, f I have mixed feelings, but let's hope for the best. <laughs> let's rest. <laughs> so I kind of... I kind of want to ask you a question of what it's taken to pursue your dreams here in California. Um, I moved to LA and long story short, I had to drive every single day two hours and a half to go to work, two hours and a half to get back, wake up every single day at three in the morning because I started work at six so I had to be there ready, prepared beforehand. My entire payment, which was nothing, uh, went to the my car rental and to gas and it was just crazy. Then I moved closer to work with a married couple and I used to ride my bike to work every single day and a lot of people see the final product and they see you know oh wow you've accomplished many things or you've accomplished something but they don't see the struggle that it takes to get from point A to A to point B yeah and there is also just strength in that there is value in that because that makes you be a better person throughout and it makes you even want it more and just strive for things more and then that'll also tell you apart from the rest because I mean if it was easy everybody would do it yeah. so everybody would be onto something but you know it's when things get real and when things get hard that you are set apart from the rest that you still kept the fight out of tears <laughs> A lot of hard work and, and I take this very humbly because I don't believe that I'm not like, oh my gosh, I'm on the way to the Emmy. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> to me, it's like, you know, it's, it's just part of the process. It's just part of, you know, little by little things will move along. But financially, like sometimes I would go to the dollar store and I was like, okay, you can choose five items to really eat for the rest of the week. And I don't want to call my parents. I don't want to be like, hey, mom and dad, sorry, I didn't make it. You yeah. know, like I want to the struggle show them. them. <laughs> yeah, no, I want to show them. Gosh. Yeah. Uh, I wanted to, if anything, be helpful to them, you know, and show them that, yeah, their daughter is at least trying to make it. So little by little, like I just kept striving and striving and striving and striving and trying my best to do everything the best I could. Like, you know, it, Anything that was given to me, even the smallest thing. I think it's shaped you so much in this walk. Like, you know, now you're in Fox, yes, but it, it took from you to being Treya TV to um, Univision, right? Univision and then now Fox. So it's like, it's all a journey. Like, we don't know what to expect. We just know that we have to, like, not give up. Mm -hmm. And so what's, like, a big advice that you have for them, like, for... Whoever is watching in this moment, when it comes to like following their dreams and something of desires they have within them, but they don't know how to do it or what they can like, what to expect along the way. Never take no for an answer. Nobody knows what you have inside of you, only do, you do. And if you believe in yourself, then the rest of the world will believe in yourself. But many times we don't believe in ourselves and then that's why everything crumbles because people tell us no, people tell us we're not good enough, people tell us we're not, we don't have what it takes. Uh, excuse me, sir, do you know who I am? <laughs> no, thank you. You move don't know on, what I've along. been through, all right? Move along, you know? So, and sometimes it, it, 
it's easier said than done. Yeah, of you course. Know? Sometimes we go through so many things that people tell us so many negative things, and we're like, we we end up believing them. Yeah. But don't don't give them the benefit of the doubt. You know what you have inside of you, and just grab it full force and explode that. Make it shine. <laughs> so um, I just wanted to kind of give you a little behind the scenes of my sister's life and everything that she's all about. Um, she's definitely my biggest role model. Okay, what do you follow her? No, like, like, <laughs> we'll do that did. later. But right now, it's, it's all fine. about you. Okay. <laughs> so I just wanted to go ahead and like shine a light on her life because she's been my biggest role model like my whole life. <laughs> no time for ugly tears, please. We're on our way. To not trying to cry yeah. out here. <laughs> tears before the Emmys. So yeah, my sister, you know, she took that leap of faith um, five, five years, years ago, ago, and I remember when we were in Florida, and she was like, um, she's like, what do I do? Like, this is my dream. Like, but I don't feel like I'm gonna grow here in Florida. And I was like, well, take the leap. There's nothing like. Like we have to take the leap sometimes and that's something that she did and she took it for fours like Honestly, she's the strongest person that I know because I know it's been really tough out here We are we're really family oriented and you know her being without us has been hard But she's taking the punches and the fact that we're on our way right now It's a blessing and I think it's like the favor of God within us that he saved us for so much and that we're witnessing all the amazing promises that God has said over our lives. I'm still shaking because <laughs> because it just it's this is such a big moment for our family. Um, I really believe that she's paved the way for us, you know, my brothers and sisters and my family. And she's had it really, really tough. But um <laughs> she, she's had it really, really rough, but I'm just thankful because you know, because I know <laughs> Everybody's crying. I'm sorry. <laughs> but I mean this. <laughs> but I just know how rough she's had it. And even so, she's still provided for our family. Just so thankful because she's been the woman of God that I've looked up to my whole life. And because of her, like, I'm who I am now. And I'm like, e, what the heck? I feel like Not right now. she needs to get, I don't know, I just feel like she needs to get praised more than she, like, she originally gets praised. Because obviously in this industry, she, she has gotten a lot of hate. And so I, I always congratulate her no matter what it is. And if people want to say something towards her, I'm like, you know what? It's all right. Because at the end of the day, it's what God says about you and not what people have to say. So I, I'm just so excited. And right now, my dad wants me to show the view in really the quick. In the middle of it all, you always see God's favor. And you always hear I just want to show the view because my dad, my dad is trying to tell you guys, show you guys the view and stuff. <laughs> yeah, but she's been We're in the Bay yeah. Area. We're in San Francisco, baby. Woo! Yeah, her boss and everybody around her, her co-workers, they tell her, like, you are such a light, you're such an inspiration, you're, you motivate me, and, like, you know, they've been able to see God through her, and it shows us that, you know, God is not only seen at church, God is not only seen in a temple, in a building, God is everywhere, God is within us, and everywhere we that we church. go, we are the church, and we are the light, so wherever we go, it's like, we are to just shine who God is in our lives. So, you know, actually been like, what's so different about her? And that what's so different is that she has God within her. Is that, yes, she's driven and she's decided on her dreams, but it doesn't mean that, like, just because we're Christians, we don't get to, like, participate on, like, our dreams or, like, our, no, our aspirations. It's no, it's even better. We get because to, like, go for Because we know that God is on our side and that no matter what, everything turns out to be a learning lesson. And it's just so amazing. So tonight we're praying for the best. I mean, even if it's, like, one, like... Honestly, whatever, happens, whatever it is, whatever so happens. happens. But um, at the end of the day, yes, we're hoping for the best. Because <laughs> she deserves it and she killed it. And like, oh, uh, we're praying. So, so you know, you know. No, if I could know. do a little like, oh, well, for my sister, I would right here. But like, the Emmys already, like, they voted for her or whatever. So <laughs> uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, tonight's going to be a great night. Okay, we're walking in. Woo! -woo. <laughs> Get it, girl. Look at her. Woohoo, girl! We have officially arrived. Officially arrived to the Emmys. And uh, there's a lot of pretty, pretty fancy people. Hi. You know, you're legit. They have all these.
project that the answers are just more. You better be having a heart attack right now. Oh my god. VJ, we did 24 hours Spanish. One or two. Uh -huh. Wait, Shaking. That's hard. That's a hard one. Yeah. Did you have your? Yeah, I have her again. It's like family victory. Got a picture of all the two here. Big smile. Hey, look at them. We're gonna do this for a few, but we can't. Hey, mom. No, 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 no. Speed up, speed up. Let's go to the family. Our third one. What? Girls! Sweeping the floor out here. Guys, so this is what an Emmy feels like. This is pretty awesome. And three. Florida got the hardest one to get for the God is faithful. I hear it. By the way, do you like how I shine? Todos mirando a Tai, todos mirando a Tai. Again, never forget to subscribe. Um, Let's my, go! My family loves you guys. My yeah, sister's amazing. Subscribe. So, see you guys next time. Bye.